So I presume I want to be at the angel and not the devil, right? I feel like I might be trapped here for the rest of my life. Yes. Oh, thank God. Oh, I'm so happy to see a different puzzle. Maybe knowing oh, it's what that snake. snake symbol means will help oh, me figure the, uh... out what the others mean. It's the Aurora Ouroboros, right? Alchemy, the attempt by ancient practitioners to turn base metals into gold in their search for perfection and immortality. Distilled? Woo! <gasps> Holy shit. Whoa. Sounds like the big guy out there just took a step. What, did we just move a statue in real life? Congratulations for progressing this far. Your goal may not be inside, but it is very, very close. If the eyes of the Mercury statue in the library are looking up and the statue is facing east, I can remove the wand from its hand. Hello, lovely people. Welcome back to the Curse of Blackmore Manor. Uh, damn. There's a lot going on right here in this whole joint. At some point, we're going to forge something, clearly. We've read this, right? I'm pretty sure we read everything and I took photos of everything. Did we read this book? Did I even see this one? Oh, hello. Peephole. Main Leddle. Guessing that's a V. Chimes and peephole. What oh, peepholes in this place? I guess I better take some more photos. Oh, the moving rooms, yeah. Well lock. Ooh, there's like a little side bit off of there that I guess I hadn't noticed. Interesting. Interesting. Why are there so many peepholes in this castle? That feels like weird, right? Welcome, dear initiate, pride of the Penvillain heritage. Here you will face many trials, but persevere, for your reward shall be the knowledge of those who have passed before you, and the honour of those to come. You have demonstrated your worthiness by negotiating the moving rooms and mastering the alchemy test, which our father Albert created to protect his laboratory. Now you will help protect our heritage by creating yet another test for new initiates to pass. For my part, I have set this tradition in motion with the establishment of the rules of Penvalin inheritance, and have enlisted the Bossany family to oversee our efforts and discoveries. So is Ethel going to be a Bossany? I can't remember what her surname is. There are six columns in the Great Hall, each hiding a brave knight who will direct movement of the Oil of Enlightenment to this forge, Oh, in which a key shall be created to reveal the secret of our father, Randolph. The secret must be well guarded. Hide the final solution to unlock this secret in your coat of arms and in the silent book. Let my words, woven in cloth, be the guide to finding the first key to opening the column decorated with Jupiter's mighty bolt. My words, woven in cloth. The, um, I'm going to take a picture of this as well, even though it's going to be impossible to read on my phone. That's the, um, the thing in Jane's room. Lacking my grandfather's wit and wisdom, I can only add to his genius. His tiles are now locked. The key is to be found near a staircase that sings. But the forge cannot work without being tempered by water. If the well is empty, a devious lock hidden in the passages underneath the manor will return it to its watery state. Dear friends, dear Penvalins, I fear my time is soon ended. My efforts to protect those in need will soon seal my doom. I have constructed a column to represent Mercury on whose swift wings would that I could escape these trying times. By moving the hands that protect my home with their alarm... Alarum chimes? My father's work will release the wand. My return to our ancestral home is welcomed with neither gladness nor the embrace of family, but no force of a misguided man can destroy our tra tradition. I have endeavoured to make our secrets even more firm. To bring fire to the forge, tame the master guardian gargoyle and his two companions with Mercury's wand. But be of fleet first. Fleet feet? Fleet feet! Time is of the essence. Once you've completed this task, apply the wand to the depository for the forge's fuel. There, oil and fire will mix. What a curiosity, what a fortune, what a dream! To know that these strange riddles and puzzles have endured for so many generations, what an honour to contribute. And how busy I have been to bring the joy of, this dis of discovery to you, my children's children. 
My playful companion hides the loving point of Venus's arrow. With this point, you will assist the ordering of the knights and block the passage of oil to the forge. Or the knights who block the passage of oil. How can a forge work without the sweet essence of air to fan its flames? Seek the curious puzzle in this room to help poor... Aeolus? Capture those unruly winds. Oh, okay, so the guy from the wind puzzle, we're trying to capture the wind. How I wish I could have met you. Do I have to do all of these to unlock the forge? Because, dear God. So many years have passed since I first stepped into this strange universe. Using my coat of arms and star charts, you will soon discover how to open my moon box and find the special lens hidden within. I found the lens. Use this lens in my telescope to see five special muses. Select each one in the correct order and Betty will wage your grandmother's key. Oh, Betty will, okay. Take a photo of that. With the very same lens, find the secret panel hidden in my room. There you will discover a most intricate puzzle that hides the key to the Column of Moons, Bridget. After discovering countless wonders around the world, what joy it is to find such mysteries at home. My dear grandchild John, on this day, your first birthday, I complete my destiny. A dragon now watches over the manor, and a column is dedicated to Saturn, the god of time. With time, you will discover the passage that hides its key behind a target. Aim well and throw with force, and the key shall be yours. How sad that only a few will revel in this secret. Fucking hell, there's a lot. We're nearly there, though. Is it I who completes the key to guard the last column? So be it. Help my dear amphibious friend. Froggies! Cross the conservatory's pond, and the Mars key shall be yours. John Charles Harold Penvalin. My computer will help you find the Saturn key. Be not afraid. I share the sentiments of our dear distant grandmother, Penny. I, too, wish to have known you, children. Known you, my children. Be strong and just in all that you do, Alan. Yes, a great shortcut through Father Albert's moving rooms is to open and close the Mars door two times without advancing. Ah, oh, I wish I'd read that earlier. Yeah, I got that in the end, though. Thanks, lad. Wow, that was pretty crazy. That was a lot. I go into this like, yeah, I think I've read everything in here. Um, And then it's like, no, here's 10,000 things to do. Here's a million pieces of information. So where's that puzzle at then? It's up those stairs, isn't it? Or is it here? No, that's something else. Here it is. So, I want to capture these four winds. <laughs> no! Okay, that apparently failed. I thought I had to press the blue on to start. Why is it no? Oops. Oops. I thought I had to... That's the only thing I can press. Okay, now it's fine? Alright, I've got to try and capture these things. Blowing me away, you bastard. Okay. Stop. Okay. No. I got one. No. What? Okay. Well, fine. Sometimes it seems to just kill me when I start. Okay. Well, he'll get me if I do this. Can I jump down two then maybe then? Oh, son of a gun. I'm so confused! Alright, okay, right, okay. Like, let's do it. So touch the black thing, die. Oh, he's gonna keep blowing me that way, isn't he? <laughs> Fuck! No! I wonder where that no sound is coming from. So I guess we always go into the middle to start. That's... I don't understand how you can die on your very first turn when you haven't even done anything. That's crazy, right? How 
how can that be the case? How can this be? There's nothing else I can do. Okay, right, I'm alive. He's gonna blow me downwards, right? Yeah. Um. I. Ah, this is so stupid. This puzzle is ass. mistake might have been trying to get them when they're already on top of the black things because that is how I die Fuck, son of a gun oh it's tempting but then I would just die I think that is the problem oh and likewise here this is stupid hard this is real hard Son of a bitch. Just kind of trying to trap that. Okay, it works. I got one. No! You son of a gun! Fuck. Oh my god, this is going to take ages. <laughs> okay, I've done two again, right? Don't get excited. Bloody hell. Okay. So this one sort of jumps between these side ones. Do I have to move? They ain't moving. Are we trying to like wait and game each other right now? Are we playing chicken? I want to step in front of him because then he'll blow me away. This is so stressful. Yes. Oh my god. Okay, one left. Please, please, please. Please. Okay. <laughs> I see how it is, buddy. Oh my god. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. Um. Yes? Yes? It sounds like air is going to the forge. Woo! I did it! I did a puzzle! A hard puzzle as well. Okay, air is going to the forge. Great. So that is one of the many millions of Penvalin's uh, things then. Okay, the forge has air. Uh, okay. You seem that an initiate would be reading it, which is something we think what she said in the letter could be real important. Yeah. I think that might be everything I can do in here yet. I think everything else might just be... Oh, we're in here again. Right, we're gonna do the trick. One. Two. And there should be a little passageway, yeah, like we saw in the thingy. Hello. This reminds me of that picture I saw in the mutus labor. 
I'm supposed to press the button under the blue triangles I want to move, then press the one under the group I want to move them to, until I wind up with a group of just four triangles. Okay, it's nice of Nancy to tell me how to do the puzzle. Um, okay, so. Water. Water. Uh, water? Water. <laughs> uh, hold on, let me start again. Water. 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 Water? Water. Water. Yeah? If I open the door now, I'll flood the place. Oh, right, because I just filled it with water. <laughs> that checks out. Oh my god, we're on a roll today. Okay. Oh, so now I can do the frog thing, right? Because water will be back on in the frog zone. The froggy zone, right? Oh, my god. I can get my way out of here. At least I don't have to worry about the glow sticks anymore. This is exciting! This is very exciting! Okay. Knock knock! Hello? Hi, Hello. It's Ned. I've been dying to know how things are going there. What's the latest? Hey, Ned. Um, it's a big fun house. This place may look like a staid English manor, but it's really just one big fun house. Why do you say that? Because every time I turn around, there's another door that I have to figure out how to open. This one door went to a slide that took me back down to the first floor. No kidding. Yeah, it's and awesome, man. And the last door I found, I discovered this old forge. Forge? Isn't the thing you use to heat metal and make swords and stuff? Right. So what are you going to do now? Well, actually, the forge looks like something I saw in this strange book Jane has in her room, which means I should probably check it out more thoroughly. Probably hasn't been used for centuries. That's the thing. It looks like it has been used recently. I mean, relatively recently. Certainly within the past 50 years or so. What would someone be using a forge to make in this day and age? There was also this big keyhole in the lab. What about a key? No key. Well, there you go. Maybe that's what has to be forged. The key that goes in that keyhole? That'd be my guess. Linda's stepdaughter Jane has a weird picture book in her room. Each of Jane's, Jane's ancestors... Uh... Linda's stepdaughter Jane? She has this really weird picture book in her room. What do you mean, a picture book? I mean, pictures are all that's in this book. No words, just these strange hand-drawn images. And the book is old, like it's been around for centuries. Drawings, huh? Maybe it's uh, some kind of an ancient instruction manual. You know, for people who didn't know how to read. Could Maybe. Be. When I asked her about it, Jane said her grandfather gave it to her. And then... And then what? And then she changed the subject. Hmm. Sounds like that book may prove to be pretty important. Thank you for doing an exposition phone call Apparently, with me, Ned. Each of Jane's ancestors had different coats of arms. Really? That's odd. You'd think there would be just one coat of arms for the whole family. Believe me, the Pendleton family is nothing if not odd. Each coat of arms includes very distinct images and symbols. Wonder why they're so different. It's a long story, but I'm beginning to think that each Pendleton left behind a puzzle and that his or her coat of arms contains clues to solving that puzzle. Makes sense. I mean, in an oddball, Penvalinian sort of way. I don't really want to say that I think Linda's turning into the Beast of Blackmore, because I don't think she is. I'll talk to you soon. Just be careful over there. What? Be careful? I told you I'm having a whale of a time, man. Pay no attention um, to the bird behind the curtain. It, okay, Lulu. Uh, maybe... Maybe then the I should go to... What time is it? It's only 6 p.m., Lulu. Uh, maybe I should. Oh, wrong room. Sorry, Linda. Didn't mean to disturb you. I got confused. This is that Jane's room? Guess she's not in her oh, room. Oh, no, that's uh, Mrs. Whoever. Think of me. This is her room. Hey, Jane. Nancy, I'm so afraid. Someone uh -oh. just sent me this horrid message. Look at this. This house is now mine, so of this be warned. Thou hast angered me and shall soon be gone. Now Terrible look poet. on the other side. 
that symbol is a rune. Right side up, it means protection like a shield. But there, it's upside down. It means I'm in danger. I wouldn't take this seriously, Jane. Someone in this house is up to no good, and I'm determined to find out who it is. Are That'd be a good time really? for you to start telling me the truth. I mean, none of these weird things started happening until you came to Blackmore. How do I know it's not you who's behind all this? I think you can trust me. I think not. I don't think I can trust anyone right now. I wish I'd never come back to this place. It's old and cold, and I hate it. And I hate... I just don't want to be here. I know you're upset, but please, you have to trust me. I'm on your side. Uh, I should go. get going. Bye. Bye. I mean, it's fair enough of her not to trust me. But to be fair, um, the horrible stuff was happening with, with Linda started being super weird way before I got here. Oh no, not the monster one. Uh, oh. I went to the... I thought there was a, a book. There was this was one of the things. That's definitely a clue for like the first guy's thing. All right, I'm gonna go and play with the frogs. Uh, this way. Fuckies. Oh, that person had a little rainbow on their shield, on their uh, coat of arms. That's cute. Froggies. Froggies. I can hear the water now! Yay! <laughs> what? Someone deliberately set this up so they could use this squirt gun to hit those tiles over there. Fun! Okay. Oh! Oh! Okay, we don't want to go that way then. Oh! What? Is it different every time? Ah! Uh... What? How are you supposed to know? Oh, come on. I think it might be random. I think it must be random. Oh, this is ass. Oh, it, it says she can kiss the frog. Oh, okay, so I just had to did, do that until it worked. I just had to did that until it done worked. Ha <laughs> ha Thank you. What's that? Where's what that? Where, where's it? I can't even look at it. Where's it? Oh hey, I picked that up. I didn't realize. Okay. Well, I got something from a froggy. Cool. Have you seen? The well is filled up again. It's very curious, but quite wonderful. Goodbye. The pleasure is all mine, child. Yeah, that could have been anyone. That could that could have been anyone. Okay. Um, the other thing that was in the books was the uh, I still got it on me. Yeah, the we should hopefully Jane has put the telescope in our room, and we can use the eyepiece on it and do whatever the hell. Is it Eleanor that did that one? Whoever it was, um, we can use their eyepiece to see something. Can't remember the details <laughs> exactly. Yay! Oh, what? Why am I looking at the picture? Shouldn't I be looking at the stars? Ooh! Okay, right. Two, five, three. Okay, so I'm gonna note this down as well. One is the like the theater mask thing. Uh -huh. uh, four is the pipes. Two. 
to is the birdie, the parrot. Three is the harp. Is that it? Oh, five is the happy theatre mask. Is that all of them? Okay. Cool. Well, that was a thing. 